sometimes you can expect the worst and be pleasantly surprised. And I think that would describe my uh, time watching, I believe it's pronounced Emily, even though it's not how you usually spin, uh, spell Emily, from Dark Sky Films featuring this lovely young lady right here. Her name is Sarah Bogler, Bogler from Once Upon a Time. Uh, here basically some stuff happens at the start of the film with this chick and you're kind of figuring out well, what's going on here, but it kind of pieces together later. Because they're waiting, you know, the family's waiting for a babysitter to arrive to watch their kids while they go out for a big, you know, night out, a big dinner, whatever it is, anniversary, however it is in the movie. I forget, but she shows up in the place of the babysitter that's supposed to be there. And uh, basically, you know, everybody's, you know, I, I, they're not really, you know, suspicious of it that much or nothing. Um, they, they leave her with the kids, everything seems fine. But then slowly, but surely, as things progress, she starts to get a little strange. She kind of gets kind of aggressive towards the daughter. She uh, seems to let the kid, the, the little youngest kid, do whatever he wants. And then they've got like a teenage boy who's kind of starting to hit that period where he realizes he really likes girls a lot. And she does some awkward, provocative, somewhat weird stuff around him, you know, just to mess with him. Like at one time, she pretty well is on the toilet right in front of him and does what she does right in front of him. It's just, it's really kind of strange. And of course, as the movie progresses on, you know, things get darker, things get violent. Uh, people show up kind of, and kind of get a little, you know, hip to the fact something's you know, something's wrong and the kids kind of realize something's wrong. And like I said, it gets violent and it gets really, really tense. This is a really tense movie. There's, there's moments where, you know, you might think, ah, hey, it's going to be typical, you know, thriller-ish type stuff that we see all the time. But, there's some moments in this one that will really put you on the edge of your seat more times than not. And you don't always know how it's going to end. I mean, it gets pretty tense. And you know, I said, this is a real good actress right here. And as good looking as she is, she makes you do, you know, she makes you just dislike her extremely. And you hope that, you know, the kids are going to end up all right. Which is something that you normally might not, you know, expect yourself to do. If I can get that to pull in at all there, I guess I won't. But some screenshots on the back. It, uh, like I said, this is out now, I do believe, from Dark Sky Films. And it's got, you know, the making of and a trailer. So it's kind of light on the uh, the extras. But it is a very, very fun movie, I would say. It, it's, it's better than I thought it would be. It's tense. There's some pretty good, you know, graphic... Uh, I don't want to say... Well, not graphic, I guess. But there's some brutal, brutal moments that, that revolve, you know, resolve around violence. And... Um, you know, it maybe it needs some gore, maybe to actually get like a really, really high up there rating. But it, it, from where it stands now, I think I'd give it like a three and a half out of five because it, it doesn't bore you. It makes you try to figure out what's going on, and uh, it gets tense when you try to figure out well, is these people's parents going to figure out what's going on? Is she going to kill the little kids? I mean, what's what's going to happen? So, if you like stuff that that's a little bit out of the norm, you know it. it borrows from the norm but adds some new stuff to it and you just like a good tense movie that's uh not always the most pleasant thing to watch then this is definitely one you want to check out from dark sky films